Welcome. Welcome, welcome. A home in a wood. In the mountains of North Africa. Where they wait. Hungry and desperate to enter a tiny piece of Europe which they can see down below. Lenny Otte has been living in the forest for four years. So 11 of you live in here. He travelled all the way from Cameroon, but now he's trapped, an illegal immigrant in Morocco, hiding from the police. I'm a prisoner because I can't go in the street. I can't just walk in the street, they can catch me at any time. So I'm a prisoner because I don't have any liberty. So that's why I decided to come in the forest to live. This is my bunker. And there are thousands living here. An unwelcome community within touching distance of their ultimate goal, Europe. For the migrants, the mountain of uh, Gogo's mountain is the hell and Melia is Babylon for them. But this is what stands in their way. On this side of the border fence, which stretches for 11 and a half kilometers around Melia, we're in Spain, Europe. On the other side is Morocco, Africa. The tallest of the three fences is eight meters high, but the migrants have developed tactics and techniques which have proved very effective. In recent weeks, hundreds at a time have scaled the fence, filmed by the police who call it a human avalanche. Spain is spending more on policing its border. But the Spanish government's representative in Melilla is que la frontera de Melilla con Marruecos is es la frontera es una de las fronteras sur de la Unión Europea. Says the European Union needs to take action to help the country control one of Europe's most southern borders. For those that cross, there's little work, but there is somewhere to sleep. Melilla's overcrowded immigration centre. Some told me they dream of life in Britain but the authorities here plan to send most back to the country where their journey began. <laughs> Malia manages tens of thousands of crossings from Morocco every day. But it's now calling on its European partners for help to stop those on the mountain who are planning their illegal attempt to enter Europe and Spain. Tom Burridge, BBC News, in Malia.